This is, uh, this is a very personal collection. Now, when I was in high school, I had an art teacher. And she spent an inordinate amount of time trying to convince me to stop drawing things like unicorns and ring wraiths and vampires. She said that if I ever wanted to create genuine art, then I needed to draw on my own personal experience. And what I tried unsuccessfully to tell her is what I'm going to tell you all now. I do. I do. And I think you'll understand, you who are here today, when I say that this book is indeed full of deeply personal encounters with vampires and mummies and all manner of strangeness. You see, like you, my reality is just a little different to some other people's. And this is wonderful. But today is the day where uh, I have to surrender control of this book. I have to send it out into the world where uh, it's up to other people whether they seize upon it. Hello? So the thing that I'm wondering is, are our dark and far realm you know, compatriots adequately represented in this series of publications? I know that we get a pretty poor showing when we turn up in cinema and often when we get referred to on t-shirts, but on this occasion, there are hundreds of pages where we could be spelt out in all our glory. Is that really what's happening here? I remain unconvinced.